All right, folks, uh, Tim here again from High End Cheap Tech. Now, most of this video is directed at the uh, people who may be watching this and represent a company or something of that sort, uh, where they would like me to test something inexpensive. I've, I've gotten lucky, and I've had at least two uh, items to test that way. Uh, I don't mind testing anything that I have the ability to use because I can't do a good test without it. And uh, also, you no know, iffy arrangements like, well, when you provide a good review, we'll reimburse you for buying it. That's not going to happen. If you're a Chinese manufacturer, bottom line, I don't trust you. I have no way to, uh, you're going to, either send it to me or provide me through our uh, donation link enough money to buy it and get it from like Amazon share sale wherever and uh, you know through Gearbest or whatever and I'll purchase it uh, and then I'll test it all reviews of course will be totally honest so let's let's quit talking about that get right to the intro it might be interesting if you're just a subscriber. You might want to throw your two cents in at the end of this. So let's do that intro and I'll show you what we're looking at. Hopefully getting a hold of in the near future. All right, folks, I'm back. Uh, let's go over the uh, products I'd like to test in the near future, hopefully. If you're a rep for a manufacturer, you know, simple rules, you know, one, just go to the About page on a computer because it's not visible as far as I can tell on the app. Uh, on the About page is a place to, you know, click, and you'll have to do a checkbox keeps robots from sending me emails and tell me what you want me to test and I'll let you know straight up. Uh, it's going to be honest though. Never for a moment think that because you're providing me a product to test that I am just going to give it a pass. I am going to point out the pros and the cons and if the pros outweigh the cons I may still recommend it if there are no cons I'll definitely recommend it some of them will be fairly short videos like the one I did on the pop voice a lavalier mic we're using right now I think it's fantastic it works great but let's move on things I'd like to get a hold of and test and we're not talking mainstream stuff or expensive stuff if you've got like a set of these things headphones actual headphones I I absolutely abhor these little earbud things i just can't stand having them in my ears uh they just are never going to sound as good as a uh set of headphones i'm a headphone kind of guy from way back bluetooth is preferred but plugins i'll still test them i don't care uh, i'll test anything Never know, I might find a set of plug-in headphones that I think are the greatest thing since sliced bread. You'll get a good review. You can share it, move it, do whatever you want with it. Uh, next, these and similar products. Like this is the TP-Link UH400. I bought this just to test it. It's a four port standard USB coming in. You can plug any kind of device into it and it'll work. You can charge your phone through it. You, obviously you're limited because most PCs or laptops, the USB port puts out one amp. So if your phone's trying to draw two or three and then you try to plug your headphones in at the same time, uh, that's just not gonna work. Uh, powered ones would be cool. Maybe one that has a the computer connection is a USB-C. Cool. I'm I'm all up for these. I since the day I got this, except for right now, it's been plugged into my PC. It's great. It's handy. 
Uh, and speaking of plugging stuff in, cables, 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 and more cables. Let's let's face it, I got cables everywhere, you know. But I could use a few. You know, if you've got a package where you sell like six of uh, USB micros, you know, maybe three of those and then maybe three USB C's to standard USB, as long as they're charging and data, I'll pass them. I'm good. Uh, oh, this one, I got this from my Blue Studio. It's a standard old, very old USB port to a micro USB. So maybe a uh, uh, USB-C to a standard OTG cable. Fantastic. You can plug a mouse into it. You can plug the keyboard into it. You can do all kinds of stuff with it. Uh, those kind of things are fantastic. Last but not least, I've got to reach over here and grab this. Yeah, now this is not what we want to test because this has been thoroughly tested already, but cell phones. If you've got a good product coming out, I don't care what it costs, I'll test it. It's going to go through the ringer. Needs to work on GSM. That's the only kind of reception I get around here. And it'd be fantastic. I'll test it. Definitely test it. Uh, and of course, I'm hoping against hope, and it's never going to happen, but I'd love to get a hold of the new mobile G4 and test that because it has wireless charging. That'll give me another thing to add to my list of stuff to test wireless chargers. Hey, that would be cool. And of course, plug in wall chargers. I'll test those too. You know, they don't have to be super fast. Something that does like 2.4 amps, has two ports, three ports, nothing expensive. If you've got something new and innovative and you just want to get the word out, ain't going to cost you any more than sending me the product to get a video on it. Don't send me a product that sucks. I mean, it's that simple. If it sucks, it's going to get a crap review. Uh, and then Bluetooth speakers I mean I've suddenly become a fan of these darn things because they're just really groovy they work and uh, I love the Unsangle 3 it's not going anywhere I will be testing it well I, I'm done testing it I use it every day it lasts forever uh, doesn't take long to charge usually if you remember to charge it on a daily basis or every other day, it takes you about an hour and you can keep using it. Uh, and maybe some uh, gooseneck mounts like what we're mounted on here for the camera. You know, we'll shake that a little. Oh, that's scary. Uh, and then uh, perhaps uh, if you got a, a tripod system of any sort to mount a cell phone to, because I do all my recording on the cell phone. Uh, any cell phone I can get a hold of. Hint, hint, new mobile. G4, soon, please. Uh, and that's about it. Uh, if you've got any other kind of products, go to that about page. It'll be linked in the description below. And for everyone else, please subscribe to our channel. Click the little bell icon if you want to see the latest video or be at least notified of it. Uh, you can always turn off the notifications, by the way. And uh, have a great day. There'll be other videos. This is my first video of the weekend. Got a nice bright sunny day out there, so I'll try to get another one in today as soon as I think of something to talk about.